And today, we get to open this fun box from KiwiCo and learn about reptiles. Do you know what a reptile is? Well, a reptile is a creature that lays eggs, breathes air, needs sunlight to stay warm, and has scales. Have you ever seen a reptile before? Hmm, what kind of reptiles can you think of? A snake is a reptile, a lizard is a reptile, and a turtle is a reptile. Oh, did you know that? Look at this. So today, we have the materials to make a snake, play with a lizard, and decorate a turtle. Are you ready? Oh boy. Well, the first thing we're gonna do is get out all of these fun materials. Here's the stuff for the turtle. We've got googly eyes, Ugh, those are funny. Ooh, a chameleon, a lizard. Oh, and we get to play a game with them too. <gasps> Wowee, there's so many fun things to do here. <gasps> what should we do first? Maybe we should make the snake. We get to make the snake, oh boy. All right, so first we're gonna unwrap this piece of cloth here. Let's open up our stuffing. Look at this white stuff. It looks like snow, kind of. <laughs> Woo! It's snowing, Uncle Teddy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We better save all this. Okay, and now we're gonna stuff it with stuffing. Here we go. farther. Alright, now I'm going to move all the stuffing around throughout the snake so it's evenly dispersed. Oh boy! <laughs> wow! Okay! This doesn't really look like a snake yet, does it? Not really. So, what we need to do is put some eyes on this snake. Okay, so here we have a packet of eyes for all of our different projects. So let's dump them out. Alrighty, which ones look like snake eyes? I think these ones do. All right. Peel them off like stickers. <gasps> Boop. One right there. And another one right here. <gasps> That's two eyes. <sniffs> Looking like a snake, huh? Well, reptiles have scales, remember? So we've got to put some scales on this snake. Alrighty. Hmm. These are cool felt stickers. They're sticky on the back, so they'll stick anywhere. Oh, this is looking cool. All right, get a blue one. And now we can just disperse some stickers along throughout its back. But we have to save some of these because we're gonna make a turtle with these too. so we can use some more for the, for the uh, turtle that we're gonna make too. Ta-da! Look at this! It's a snake! But what do snakes have that they use to make this hissing sound? Yeah, a tongue! So let's use these to make a tongue for our snake. All right. We just need one of these. And look at this. There's a little hole right here to stick this through. There we go. <laughs> Did you hear that? 
they kind of made a horn sound. <laughs> That's silly. Wow, we our snake is really cool. What should we name him? Maybe Slithers, like Slithering Snake. <laughs> That's fun. Hey, did you know that snakes have different colored scales for different reasons? Like dark colored scales help hide from predators and light colored scales help scare predators away. <laughs> Isn't that neat? Oh boy, this is a really cool snake. Well, since we're done making the snake, let's put him over there. Now it's time to do the chameleon. Are you ready? Let's do the chameleon. So, what we'll need for that. Let's look at our handy dandy instructions. We'll need the colorful change. Oh, it says it changes colors. It says your chameleon will change colors when it gets warm. So try holding it in your hands or leaving it in the sun. Oh boy, let's see. <gasps> Whoa, it got lighter. That's pretty neat. Okay, so for the chameleon, what we're gonna do is play a game. First, we have to pop out all these little pieces. All right, so the first step is we set up all of these insects. <gasps> Look at this. This one says super worm. This one says fruit fly. Ooh, and this one says grain beetle. All right, now that we've got those set up, we've got to put eyes on our chameleon, huh? Okay, here we go. Let's stick some eyes on him. How about right there? Perfect. <laughs> Flip him over. Oops. Do the same thing on this side. Oh boy, they're a little uneven. <laughs> That's okay. All right, and now a chameleon has a really long sticky tongue so it can catch flies really easily. Flies and other bugs and insects like a superworm, fruit flies, and grain beetles. All right, so here's how we do it. We hold this thing up. We're gonna set these up over here, and I'm gonna try to knock them down with this chameleon tongue. Are you ready? Okay. <gasps> Yay, we did it! <gasps> Whoa, we did two at the same time! <laughs> did you know chameleons change colors for different reasons? Like chameleons change colors to tell other chameleons how they're feeling. Or they change colors to absorb heat. Oh, that's pretty neat. <laughs> All right, well that was sure fun playing with that chameleon game. I guess it's time for the last craft, which is to build a turtle, to decorate a turtle. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is peel off this sticky part right here. Ooh, peel off the paper. Now it's super duper sticky. Then we take this, ooh, this is a fun little special box. Oh, I like it. And we're gonna stick this onto our turtle. Now it's like a turtle shell. <laughs> All right, we're gonna rub it, make sure that it's on there nice and good. All righty. Now we get to take these right here and put them on the shell of our turtle, which is the box. Let's use the blue too. Stick those right on the front of our turtle. Hey, Mr. Turtle. Ta-da! Look at that! We made a special turtle box. Now we can put special things in there and maybe give it to Uncle Teddy or something. Look at our cool box. Did you know that some turtles can hide inside of their shell when they're feeling scared? So they can pull all four legs and their head 
inside of their shell to hide their body. And I can't see them. <laughs> That's pretty cool, huh? Wowee. Hey, I have an idea. Let's pretend that we are reptiles. Come on over here. These are fun movements we can do like reptiles. All right, so the first one is to crawl like a lizard. All right. Maybe we need a lizard tongue. Because <laughs> lizards crawl and they use long tongues to get their insects for food. All right, and the second one is hide like a chameleon. Chameleons can blend in with their surroundings. Can you see me? <laughs> That's pretty fun. All right, and another one, chomp like a crocodile. Oh boy, crocodiles have big mouths with super sharp teeth. All right. Chomp like a crocodile. And the last one is slither like a snake. Are you ready? Hmm, let's get low to the ground and slither like a snake. We need a snake tongue again. Here we go. <laughs> That's pretty fun acting like reptiles, isn't it? Well, I sure had a lot of fun learning all about reptiles with you today. And thanks a lot, KiwiCo, for sending me this awesome box to explore all these fun things. All right, well, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Hey, if you want to stay up to date on all of our fun adventures, be sure to hit the red subscribe button below.